Graziano D.I. Prima's wife has given a one-word show of support as he husband waits on Strictly Come Dancing's investigation. The dancer was axed last month after the BBC probe into the show found instances of misconduct. It came as he was accused of physical and verbal behaviour towards his celebrity partner of last year, Love Island's Zara McDermott. Bosses took action following Amanda Abington's complaints about her dance partner Giovanni Panice, which sent the show into chaos. Graziano married wife Giorda Lini back in 2022, after seven years of dating, tying the knot in a picturesque ceremony in Sicily. She's is standing firmly by her husband's side amid his ongoing Strictly battle, and has taken to Instagram to show the world she's fully behind him. Uploading a snap of her hand intertwined with the dancer, she wrote in the anniversary post. Noi, which translates into English as us. Following the announcement of his departure that made national headlines, Graziano issued a heartfelt statement on Instagram, in which he addressed his fans and stated, While respecting the BBC HR process, I acknowledge it's only right for the sake of the show that I step away. Continuing, he said, I am saddened that I wasn't allowed to offer a quote to the online news stories, and I take on board the sensitivity of the situation. There's more to this story that I am unable to discuss at this time, but I am committed to being strong for my family and friends. I wish the Strictly family nothing but success in the future. In a statement, the BBC confirmed. We can confirm that Graziano Di Prima is no longer a part of the lineup of professional dancers for the upcoming series of Strictly Come Dancing. While we would never comment on individual cases, it is well known that the BBC has established and robust duty of care procedures, and if issues are raised we will always take them seriously and act swiftly as appropriate. In a new interview, Graziano stated that he was attempting to figure it all out, amid the claims that saw him get sacked. Last month a spokesperson for the Star told BBC News. There is never a time when kicking, or any sense of that is right. And he knows that. He knows has made a mistake. He apologized at the time. The spokesperson added. But he doesn't recognize some of the issues surrounding it. The descriptions of what is being commented online, and how he remembers it, are not aligned. Graziano, who has now opened up on what he believes the scenario might have been, has since cut himself off from civilization, as he is supported by his wife at his family's farm in Sicily. Last month it was said he was receiving medical supervision, with his family left deeply concerned about his well-being, and were forced to monitor him hourly. Writing on Instagram at the time, the 30-year-old addressed the axe as he stated, I deeply regret the events that led to my departure from Strictly. My intense passion and determination to win might have affected my training regime. Respecting the BBC HR process, I understand it's best for the show that I step away. He continued. While there are aspects of this story involving external influences that I can't discuss at this time, I remain committed to being strong for my family and friends. I wish the Strictly family and the BBC nothing but success in the future.